Hello everyone. How have you been? Hopefully you all are fit, fine and healthy. And now welcome you all to your English class. Well kids, today I'm going to teach you a new interesting thing. Are you excited? Yes. Then let's take a look. flowers children have you ever been to a garden yes what do you see in a garden trees, trees and plants and many flowers yes we see many flowers in different shapes sizes and colors now we will recite a rhyme about different flowers <music> Roses are red, yellow and pink. The lotus in the pond does not sing. Yellow sunflowers face the sun. Flowers are liked by everyone. Orange marigold, oh so bright. Sweet smelling jasmine is completely white. In many many colors hibiscus is found with petals open wide it looks big and round Roses are red yellow and pink the lotus in the pond does not sing yellow sunflowers face the sun flowers are liked by everyone orange marigold oh so bright sweet smelling jasmine is completely white in many many colors hibiscus is found with petals open wide it looks big and round Now kids quickly take out your English alphabet workbook pencil and eraser Now open page number 25 in your book This is page number 25 Just now I have told you that today I'm going to teach you an interesting thing Yes We are going to learn the name of the flowers. So kids, you tell me which flower is this? You all know it. Try to identify. Very good. This is a rose. Right? Yes. This is a rose. So what is this? This is a rose. What's the flower's name? The flower name is rose. Now, please turn over the page. Which flower is this? Yes, this is a lotus. Can you tell me kids what which flower is this? Yes, this is a sunflower. Now the next page. Come to page number twenty-eight. And which flower is this, kids? Yes, this is a lily. So, how many flowers name I have taught you? Four, right? Yes. Once again, we are going to revise them. rose lotus 
सनफ्लावर लिली अगेन रोज लोटस सनफ्लावर लिली किड्स यू कैन लर्न अदर फ्लावर्स नेम ऑल्सो विच आर नॉट इन बुक बट यू हैव टू लर्न सम फ्लावर्स नेम ओके नाउ इट्स टाइम फॉर क्लास वर्क सो कम टू पेज नंबर थर्टीन At first, at the left top corner, you write down today's date. Match the picture with the correct alphabet. We have to do the matching. just like we have done in our second term and first term right yes so what you have to do you have to identify the pictures and then you have to match the alphabets with the correct pictures so at first case you tell me what is this yes this is alphabet e now tell me e for glass no it's wrong E for igloo. No, it's also wrong. E for eye. Yes, we know that. E for eye. E for eye. So, now match the alphabet E with the picture of an eye. What is this? This is alphabet B. So B for igloo. No. B for glass. No. B for bat. Yes. B for bat. B for bat. So kids match them quickly like this. This is alphabet G. So G for I. No, it's wrong. G for igloo. No. G for glass. Yes. G for glass. G for glass. So match them. Now the next alphabet that is alphabet I. So I for bat. No, I for igloo. Yes, I for igloo. I for igloo. So match them. Now come to page number fourteen. Here also we have to do the matching. This is alphabet A. So tell me, kids, A for drum? No. A for yak? No. A for X? Yes. A for X, A for X. So match the alphabet A with the picture of an X. Now the next alphabet. This is alphabet P. So P for X. No. P for yuck. No, it's wrong. P for P. Yes. It's right. P for P. P for P. So match them like this. 
Which alphabet is this, kids? Yes, this is alphabet Y. And Y for drum. No, Y for yuck. Yes, Y for yuck. Y for yuck. So match them like this. And the last alphabet. And the last alphabet is alphabet D. So D for P. No. D for yuck. No. D for drum. Yes. Right. D for drum. D for drum. So match them. Like this. Kids, have you completed? Yes, very good. Now it's time for homework. So you come to page number 15. At the right top corner, you write down homework. That is HW. So, at homework, you have to match them, okay? And also, you have to do page number 16. Here also, you need to do the matching, okay? Kids, don't forget to practice each and every exercise at your home. And also, read the flower's name, okay? Bye-bye, kids. And thank you.